trying to get ready to start the video. However, Gandhi has to be in the middle of the set. There we go. Now we can start. Well, hey there and how are you today? My name is Carla. I'm an adult doll collector and you are in my hangout. Today we are in my made over mini brands closet because I finally got a hold of the mini brand fashion 80 plus iconic minis to collect capsules. So let's get started with, so you have the Zuru mini brands fashion 80 plus iconic minis to collect means that the, these capsules will have the shoes. If you have a capsule that says 60 plus, you're not getting shoes. Just saying. I don't make the rules, I just follow them. So here's what the capsule looks like, otherwise it looks the same, and here is the UPC code if you need it. And I can hardly wait to get into these because it's shoes, people, it's shoes. Let's get into these and see what we have. So the first one, and of course, the mini fashion capsules are famously difficult to get into. So here's the first one. And what do we have? I'm going to dump it out. So we have, um, before we get into the bags, here is the collector's guide and the ultra rare has changed to include we still have the Siamese kitten we still have the pink belt still have the red backpack but now we have look at those shoes Ooh, I would like those we have all the same purses the purses did not change the accessories did not change but Look at that, shoes, shoes. And it's been also my understanding that different shoes fit different dolls in different ways, which I also like. It means there's a little something for everybody. And of course we go to the other side and all of this does remain the same. These haven't changed until you get down to Yep, more shoes. Let's see what we get. Okay, well, this doesn't feel like it's got a lot in there. Let's see. But we, ooh. <gasps> the Christian Louis Vuitton shoes. Yes, sir. Okay, so these shoes have... So we have the bottoms, which are painted red, of course. And I guess it's, they're supposed to look like they have like, um, I guess, a, a like a fishnet um, footing. So they're probably more like, I don't know, maybe intended to be boots. Does this have to untie? Nope, it seems to have some stretch. Okay, well, so we got the shoes, yes sir. And of course we have um, this necklace with the earrings that match. Excellent. That makes me happy. So what pur purse comes with this? It's little. That'd be funnier than heck if it comes with a heart purse. Because with the red underneath the shoes, let's... <laughs> Oh, Lord. Okay. This purse is a um, dupe of a Gucci purse. Now, the Gucci purse is um, kind of coated with gemstones. So, and this purse is not. But it is, um, the Gucci was the closest I could come to finding this particular purse. Because, as you know, the um, mini brand fashion bags are dupes of real world upscale and designer bags. Okay, now these have this is how the shoes look on a regular made to move body Barbie. And they fit quite well. Let's try them on a couple other body sorts. 
All right, I did try these shoes on a curvy and a tall. Of course, I believe the curvy and tall Barbies have the same size feet. And um, the, if you're willing to stretch the fabric out, they'll fit. But otherwise, these shoes are best on a regular size doll. Okay, next one. So these two bags feel a little bit more substantial. Nice, I like that. I'm going to say that I was, I know when the Series 3 first came out, I was not at all thrilled with it. I mean, the purses were fine. I like the purses just fine. I like the scarves, but I was underwhelmed by the accessories being mostly that jewelry and the stickers, you know, and the, and the you know, the press on nail things. I was... I, I was thinking it was their weakest series. With the introduction of shoes, though, that's kind of a game changer. So, let's see what we have next. I don't know which I'm more excited to open first, so I'm going to go with this. What do we have? Ooh, oh, okay. So, we have the Black Beret. Yeah, I was hoping for that. And so we do get some gold um, press-on nails. Now, the occasional press-on-nail thing, I can live with that. And we have the Converse. All right, okay, that's kind of an interesting look. So let's try out the shoes. I'm going to try them out. So she's going to be our model, our regular size made-to-move model. So let's see how they fit her. She's a regular size doll. You might want to put socks on, but overall, though, they fit quite well. So let's try them on her, because she's barefoot. So let's try these shoes on her. Oh, yes. They fit a Kirby perfectly. Nice. And just to double check, let me see. I believe they fit a tall perfectly too. Still, I'm going to put these both of these on her because she's wearing the red dress. That's really the only reason. And let's try this beret on. And here's how she looks in the beret. Next one. Okay. Hmm. I do not know what's what. Well, let's start with this bag. Because I know every peg is supposed to have a pair of shoes, I'm excited, just as excited about the one as the other. And, oh, ooh, look at those. And you also get these sunglasses, which I do like. Okay, it comes with this, with the gold headband. So if I'm right, this will come with that white, creamy white purse with the, with the pink flowers. It does not. However, wow, okay, it came with this. Hmm, okay. So this is the Louis Vuitton purse. I'm sure you all knew that. Let's try them on anyways. So again, we'll start with a regular size Barbie. Okay, so it's ruby on a regular size Barbie, although I'm sure if you wore, put on socks, they would fit just fine. So let's try the curvy Barbie again. Okay, so here we go. And again, they fit the curvy Barbie much better. <laughs> and the shoes actually kind of uh, suit the dress. So you can see all the little details. And we'll do the tread. Next capsule. So what do we have in here? Okay, well, I, I don't know. I do love that now with the um, inclusion of shoes, the other bag feels more substantial. Definitely approve of this. So we got these per these boots, which I'm super excited about. And then we got the Louis Vuitton scarf. The Louis Vuitton headband. 
and the Louis Vuitton bag. A full look. Yeah, buddy. Oh, check that out. That fits wonderfully. I love this. And this is a whole look. I'm just gobsmacked again. I love this. Yay! So we know if it, we know it fits the, the tall. Now the now the tall and curvy both have the same size feet. However, their calves and ankles are not quite the same. So let's see how up it does fit the curvy too. More love curvies. I'm so glad they needed it. It's all of them. Oh, yes. This is awesome. Next one. So far, it's I think it's been great. Okay, so what is this? Well, let's start with this one. And this one is... Ooh. Oh, oh dear. <laughs> okay, the... um. I definitely know what shoes these are. I'll post a real world picture of these when I edit this video. These real world sh these are Louis V. I mean, these are Valentino shoes in real world. Yep. Oh, hi, Gandy. Again, come on through. Look at this cat. Okay, so I also did get this like charm kind of gold um, belt which I actually like. And I got this scarf, which I, I do like the scarf. I'm not sure about the pink and the orange together, but let's see what purse it is. It's light. All right, I think I know what purse this is. And it is. It is the perfume purse. Gandy! No, no, Gandy. <sighs> you seeing this? <laughs> Gandy? 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 <laughs> Gandy? <laughs> I, I, come on now. <laughs> Let's, look, you. Come on. <laughs> Come on, Gandy. <laughs> yes, I love you too, but now come on, you. <laughs> come on, come on. Come on, get on down from there now. Come on. Come on, get on down from there. No, one way or the other. Come on. <laughs> You've got to pick a direction. Thank you. Oh, dear. Now, this is a real world, world purse. It is a Dolce & Gabbana um, novelty purse. It looks almost exactly like this. So, okay. Well, although I think these shoes are are unfortunate looking, I'm going to try to put them on a doll. Okay, so here's how they look on. So, uh, this is a one and done. I dare say that they will also fit, though, a curvy doll. Next one. Okay, oh, okay, this feels like one of the pink pails. So, I'm also open this up. And it's, it, it's the blue paint can. And the paint cans, believe it or not, are also Louis Vuitton. They really like Louis Vuitton with this line, apparently. And there are many other um, designers that also did paint cans, but Louis Vuitton did uh, these particular ones. I mean, not exactly, exactly this, but you'll see. They, yeah. So we have the paint can. <laughs> I actually kind of like them, but maybe because I think they photograph so well with, um, with my own little mini me. <gasps> Ooh. Well, that's a way to G it up. Okay. Whoops. Let me make sure I've got everything out and that's moose that you hear in the background okay so with the paint can you get the gray cat you get one of these which i have i stand corrected that these are actually neck ties this is a pretty one the prettier one out of all of them look at that shoe wow 
That is something. Okay, I do, I'm glad that the feather doesn't go all the way down. You have your painted heel again and your nude bottom. But let's see how they look on the doll. Okay, so here's how the shoes look on a regular doll. I trimmed off the extra feather that's supposed to go around because that part of the feather was just looking, already looking haggard. And there was no way it was never going to, you know, stop looking haggard. I was, once I fastened the shoes, I was able to, I actually fastened the shoes and then put them on the doll. And they went on pretty easy. So, let's see what they look like on a curvy doll. Okay, well, yes, I would say they... They do fit a curvy, a curvy doll. However, they do look, let's, I did bring down a doll that is not a made to move doll. Her feet are just in the high heeled position. So let's see how that looks. Oh, that looks much better. All right, oh, got another paint can, but I can already tell through the paper that it's a pink one. So at least it is in the duplicate. But we have the pink paint can, which, as I said before, I actually like the paint can. So <laughs> I'm one of the weird people. I think they're they're kind of amusing. And what's in here? Well, it feels substantial. So, <gasps> ooh, on here. Oh, oh, okay. Sorry. <laughs> okay, so um. We've got the cat in this instead of in that bag. And we get the cat with the, I, at least for me, I got the cat with the paint can. And we only, we still only have the white cat, the gray cat, and the Siamese cat. So with the paint can, we also have this, uh, this, well, I guess necktie. And then, ooh. Now, I don't know a whole lot about sneakers, but... Let me get you a close-up of this. That's pretty. So, and look, and I love how it looks. The tongue is actually functional. And then here is the tread. And I love that the shoelaces also are actually functional. So first of all, we'll try our regular doll and again with socks they would fit quite well now let's try them on our curvy girl and they'll probably gonna fit her wonderfully and they do wow the curvy dolls are getting so many new shoes all of you who have your curvy dolls you know that when it comes to shoes you get You've been probably doing the same thing I've been doing, choosing between the two or three somewhat cute shoes they have for the curvy dolls. Somewhat cute. And now we're going to have a lot of cute for the curvy dolls. It's about bleeming time. Okay, so again, um, well, let's take a look at the shoes. Okay, okay, okay. All right, all right. Settle down, settle down. But I think... Okay, so in here, we have the gold bracelet. Some purple press-on nails. Wow, I had to... Look at these... Oh, boy. I really wanted these boots. A lot. Okay. Oh, they feel really soft. Well, what bag comes with the boots? Ooh, yes. It's the fringe bag. So, oh, I love this. Ooh, okay. Got, well, let's check out the boots. Okay, so these are the boots on a regular made-to-move Barbie. Let's try them on the Kirby. So let's see if the Kirby even gets some style in boots. Okay, the boots are not locked liking her calves. It will go up. The calves. Okay, so these over-the-knee boots will fit. 
a curvy. Okay, and they fit best on a tall Barbie. Okay, hmm. Well, let's see what this is. And in here, oh, something else I didn't, I, I don't have. Okay. So, of course, we have the lipstick. But look at these sneakers. Oh, I love these sneakers as well. Look, so we have the tread on the bottom. Look at that. Again, you have the functional tongue. Oh, I love them. And it came with this silver necklace. Let's see what purse. <gasps> Ooh, the blue one, which has this crosshatch kind of, you know, woven um, way you've done it. And of course it, it's, you know, has a magnetic flap and look at the inside of it. That is done so beautifully, isn't it? And it does say mini fashion on the side. Okay, let's try the next one and see how this goes. Okay. It's round. How obviously we know what that means. We know it is the pink basketball purse. And it is. And you know, it it if it's styled right, I think this purse is really pretty smashing when it's styled right. What accessories do we have? Do you hear that cat upstairs? He is nagging at my daughter right now. <gasps> Ooh, okay, so we've got the Burberry scarf. Now, I like this scarf a lot myself. I think it's pretty. I do. I think it's pretty. I like that it's, you know, it's actually mildly stretchy, but I like that. It's, you know, and I like that it's narrow. I like the colors in it. I, I, I do like it. And, oh, oh, okay, so, um, we have another, we have the black glorified AM ankle monitor. <gasps> Look at that. Look at that beautiful, oh, that is a gorgeous shoe. Look at that. Once again, the functional tongue, the tread on the bottom, here's from the back, whoa, okay, so again, we know it's all fit, oh, hi, Gandy, come on through, come on through, right, I think at this point, I probably will not be trying on all the shoes, unless it's one that I'm, that, unless it's a type that we happen, if we're not sure of yet. So we know this will definitely fit the curvy and everything. So yeah, so that's probably the last one for a while. I'll be trying the shoes on. Next one. Right, so we have, um, ooh, something else I haven't, this does not feel familiar. So, oh, I hope it's what I'm, it is, yay. The cage purse. I think I love this purse. I do. I think it's awesome. So anyway, I love this purse because it has, you know, it's the gold like cage and on the inside it has an inner purse, like a little satin inside purse with a drawstring. And this is by, this is definitely a, um, a designer called Rosantica with it. Oh, oh. Oh, nice. You get this bracelet, which makes sense that this bracelet would go with that purse. Get another lipstick. <laughs> yes, hi, Gandy. And, oh, look at these. I almost don't want, don't look at my horrible nails. Look at that. Oh, those, oh, I... Heaven, I'm in heaven. Okay, I do not have these buckled right now, but they do fit perfectly, I think, on the tall doll. Once again, because these are such pretty shoes, it would be nice if the curvy doll gets some love too on those really elegant shoes. Let's see, can she? Oh, look at that. Our curvies can have some sexy high heel shoes. 
Ah, but the regular dolls are kind of, um, I mean, I'm sure once you fasten the buckle, it would stay on. This has been fantastic so far, guys, okay? Um, I know I'm, I'm still have some more to open up, but I'm, go I'm going to say that you're spending 10 bucks for a ball, and I get that. However, now, though, you're getting a purse and a nice pair of shoes and some, you know, and some, like, realistic-looking shoes, which is a lot more than we used to get. So this is, I would consider this way worth it. I would, I would do it just for the shoes alone, you know, for that, because... You try to buy nice shoes online, like through Etsy, and you're paying more than 10 bucks for a nice pair of shoes, which is why I haven't bought any. Let's open this bag first. And, whoop. Oh, okay. Okay, so now I got these, these black boots, which I was really excited about. So got some more gold press on nails and I finally got the belt I hadn't gotten the belt yet so I'm glad I finally got it because I was kind of wondering what it looked like oh awesome and I got this purse yay oh I've been looking for this purse so hmm I'd never really looked seen it up like actual like up close. Okay, I do want to see what the boots look like on a regular Barbie. All right, so here are the boots on a regular made to move body. They, they fit. Let's try them on a curvy body. Let's see. They fit much better on a curvy body. Here they are on a tall Barbie. Okay, well, they, they actually fit all three quite well. I think they fit the curvy the best, but they also do fit the tall pretty well. And I finally got the belt. woo -ha. But the belt loop is going to be a challenge to keep and not lose. <laughs> I, can, I want to try on the belt on a Barbie real quick. Hey, I think it fits really nice. I don't know. I heard that I heard somewhere that they don't, that doesn't fit very well, but I think it fits rather perfect. Oh, I like it even more now. Okay. And another one. Yes, I, like I said, I bought a few. Shh, don't tell on me. So, hmm. Okay. By touching them, I cannot tell what's in here. So, what do we have in here? Okay, so I did get, okay, doubles on these shoes. That's okay. And, oh, here we go. The Gucci bow tie. Necktie, whatever. Yep, it does go around the neck. <sighs> yep, it's a look. So those of you who tell, told me that, I mean, I, I kind of believed you, but I really hoped you were wrong. Doubles on the shoes. Oh, and I did get this little um, pink. Um, at least it's a not as ugly of a you know, um, ankle monitor. I'll still probably put them on the cats. Fair warning. And okay, so we got the, the pink, the, the pink Noela purse. All right, okay. But this makes sense to have these two together. So I can see why they would do these shoes. And I've got my, I was kind of trying not to say things, things out loud, but got my first, got my first, um, shoe double. But that's okay, because, you know, I have a few Barbies. So, um, I won't complain about having more than one pair of shoes of certain styles. I have three more chances to get, I was really hoping for the red boots. Yeah, I was really hoping for these. Let's hope one of them is a red pair of boots. I mean, I won't cry too long if they're not, but still. So let's check this out. Well, <laughs> nowadays, 
you just oh okay so we have the baseball cap it's a pretty baseball cap okay I have another set of press on nails Doo -doo -doo. and another pair of these so I have dupes on the shoes let's see what purse this is now hopefully this is that white purse with the matching flowers and it is okay there we go because yeah this is a set which I think is awesome and now these are Gucci's okay so this is a Gucci purse Gucci has a whole line of the purses with the flowers and you know they have the studs around them and I'm very sure that these are also the Gucci shoes okay let's try this one let's see we have two more yeah. I can't tell what's in what yeah so in here okay nope I don't still don't know what's what so let's see okay well this oh these are cute okay <laughs> let me get the rest of this out so <laughs> uh, red press on nails the red sunglasses so far I've only gotten two pairs of sunglasses with all this but they were different you got the red pair and the gold pair and that's everything but look at these shoes oh gosh they look cozy <laughs> oh okay yep okay I gotta try these on a, on a, on a doll sorry <laughs> I do Let's try this on a regular made to move okay so that's how they fit on a regular made to move they fit pretty sturdy all oh, those are so cool so regular made to move definitely they fit can our Kirby have some slippers okay yep the Kirby can also have some slippers yay what purse comes with oh okay no so they're probably meant to be sandals so we have this purse, which is a very popular purse. And this purse is a Gucci purse. Gucci does does have your, your brown suede with this shade of pink for trim. And Gucci has a whole line of purses with the mushrooms. I'm very sure that this is Gucci. So that's a look. Oh, my goodness. Okay, yeah. Last one. Let's see what we get. okay again i do not know what i have i think this is the hat the the brim hat which i already have yep okay i already ooh, okay it was it isn't the red boots but it is another pair is open for so okay so we've got this white brim hat let's go have in here okay okay whoop, we've got the hound's tooth sunglasses look i oh look at those <laughs> I was hoping for these. Oh dear. I've got to do it. I've got to see what they look like on the doll. Be right back. Okay, so here's how this looks on a regular made to move body. Now, I did on these shoes um, take, pull back on this part here, and then I moved the buckle down good chunk of the way in order to so it would close because of, otherwise it just it was just going to be it was too big for all the dolls so I haven't done that on this one but I did on this shoe and it made a huge difference now I will check it out on on the curvy as well and this is what it looks like on the curvy and again whoops and again, I think it fits the curvy better. Oh, they're cute, they're cute, they're cute. And wow, you know, it's amazing how many of the shoes from this, uh, from this mini brand work with this dress. <laughs> 
wow, this, this dress is actually kind of like, uh, kind of works with everything. I, I like it. Okay, so what first? I'm betting it's going to be the white tote. And it is. Okay. But I like the white tote. In fact, it's kind of a whole look here now, isn't it? It makes sense for this to be a whole look. I like it. Okay, well, that's the end of this video. All right, well, thank you very much for joining me as we got to open a bunch of the mini series fashion series three with shoes. And I think the shoes were the game changer. The doubles I got on the shoes made sense because there's obviously more purses than shoes. So some of the shoes are going to be doubled up with different purses. But I'm, but you know, but they worked with what they were. So I'm, yeah, it was great. Makes me like the purses, the bags, even more now that I've seen what what shoes can go with the bags like the heart bag and those black shoes going to have fun styling the dolls and doing a video with the dolls all the dolls styled with the bag with the stuff that goes together so again so thank you for joining me i'm just yes i love it let me know what you think so um if you like this video please hit like um, if you're a subscriber, thank you very much for being a subscriber. You, I know I say it every video, but that's because it's true. Every single video, I love my subscribers. So if you become a subscriber, I'm also going to adore you because that's how it works. Now, I have provided you with a red button on this side and it says subscribe and it's free. <laughs> you heard? Yes, you heard. It's true. It's free. Cost you nothing. So um, sharing is caring, so definitely go ahead and share this video. I'm guessing that there's a lot of different people out there who are wondering what the shoes look like. What do they look like on the different doll? Comment down below. Let me know what you thought. Um, if you take the time to comment, I will take the time to answer. Now I'm going to let you guys get on with your day. Thank you for giving me some of your time to me. So whatever time of day, night, or morning it is, I hope it's fantastic. I'm, and I'm out of here, so goodbye.